Hey everybody, welcome back, Wake Makers Project Boat, and today we're tackling audio. So depending on your boat and your project needs, audio can be a simple or a complex uh, install. Uh, today we have some in-boat speakers that we need to remove, as well as a sub going in and some tower speakers. Joel did get a little excited with getting some of those speakers removed and already removed the windshield, but we've got a few more to go, so let's get to it. All right, now that we've got our old speakers out, we've got the new ones screwed down in place, being the same size, fairly easy install. We do still have our head unit and amp to get out and put the new ones in. All right, so we're now gonna be running new speaker wire for our speakers that we've installed. We kind of noticed that the speaker wire that was in there was just garbage. So we're running new ones of that, uh, heavier gauge, heavier duty. We're also running RGB wire to power the lights that are on the speakers. We have to run everything up underneath the seats, under the lip, to our amp in the front, and we'll have everything powered up. Now we're in the observer's compartment. Um, trying to figure out how all the power is going to be distributed here. Um, the boat came with one battery. We're gonna add a second battery and a battery switch over on this side. So we gotta be uh, aware of our, our room in here. We're gonna have a massive sub right where I'm sitting. So we're gonna throw the uh, Wet Sounds inline fuse over here, kind of near the battery switch. Uh, and that will have this big red cable running through it. And then we're gonna have this distribution block. Uh, this will allow us to power both amps off of that single power cord or the positive and negative. Uh, we'll put this on this back wall and then amps will go right here on this back wall here. Um, and then uh, just connecting the, the amps and the speaker wire and we should be all set. Nice. Now that we've got our amps mounted and everything, along with our fuse and distribution block, we're gonna run some RGB wire through our tower for the tower speakers. Right on, now that we've got our RGB wire run through our tower, we can get to mounting those tower speakers along with getting our sub mounted. 
So this is not two subs. I've been corrected. This is one sub and a passive radiator. <laughs> I don't know what that does. It allows airflow in the box. More airflow in the box for bigger boom. How many boom booms you got in there? <laughs> He's really bumping. <laughs> and then that guy is going to comment, so this is why it takes you a week to do anything. <laughs> this is why we keep changing outfits. <laughs> All right, so that wraps up our audio install on our project boat. So along with new in-boat speakers, we've got those tower speakers, a new sub, along with amps to power everything. Uh, we do still have a few minor projects to go on our project boat, but we hope to hit the water soon. So stay tuned for the next video.